Hey everybody, this is JP2112 and today I'm going to show you my settings for recording using DX Story. As some of you may know or may not know, I record gameplay in Minecraft. So I'm going to show you the settings that I use for recording high quality videos in HD, uh, I think, t yeah, 1080p. So let's get to it. First of all, let's start at the first tab here. Uh, I don't really do anything with this. Second tab, uh, I only show the video frames per second. I don't show the right file frames per second. And I have it in uh, green and red for recording. Next tab is the folder. I have two folders here. I have a USB drive that I record to, a USB 3 and I have a regular folder on my hard drive that on one of my hard drives that I record to as you can see the megabytes per second is much lower so usually what I'll do is I'll record to the USB drive and then just move the file over to my hard drive when I want to do the actual editing uh, but you can set this up however you want however I do recommend that you use a separate uh, separate hard drive other than your, the hard drive that has Windows and you know all your programs and Minecraft and everything on it uh, just to minimize the amount of lag. For keys you set this up however you want. I have it uh, F9 is my start and stop record and F12 for screenshots. Now for one of the more important tabs is the recording, movie recording. I use the Lagarith codec you can just Google that or find another YouTube video that shows you about how to find, how to download, how to install the Lagarith codec. What I do is I click on configuration. Under configuration, I uncheck everything except use multi-threading. For mode, some people tell you to use YV12. I don't have no idea why. Uh, the quality I found was kind of bad. I use RGBA, which I think is the highest setting. For frames, I use 30 frames per second because that's generally what uh, I think that's what YouTube recommends. That's the highest I think that they'll accept. And Minecraft is also goes in increments of 15 or, or 30 frames uh, per second at a time. So uh, 30 ma will line up ma uh, pretty exactly with what Minecraft already has. And for scaling, I record 100% of the of the Minecraft window. Okay. Now for audio, uh, as you can see, I have two channels set up. I have uh, channel one is my speakers, which, if you didn't know, uh, I use the Corsair Vengeance 1500 headset. So channel one is the speakers, so that the sound you hear out of the computer, out of Minecraft, is going to be coming into the speakers, and that's going to be recorded in channel one. Channel two is the microphone is going to be recorded by DX Story. So the microphone on the headset is going to be recorded. So if you wanted to add additional channels, you click the plus sign. If you want to delete channels, you hit the minus sign. Really, I can't really see any use for any other channels other than two. You know, you want to record the sound in your computer, which also possibly could include a Skype call. So if you're doing a Skype call, a, a group chat, or TeamSpeak or some other kind of thing, you would record it along with the audio from the game in your speakers. That would be channel one. And then channel two would be your voice. For the uh, codec and the encoding, I use DVD quality, which is 16-bit stereo at 48,000 hertz. And that's for both of these. I think that's how it came when I first installed it, and I never really touched this. For screenshotting, all I did was check to make sure it's PNG. That seems to be the best quality. Otherwise, I didn't really touch any of this. I don't really use this for screenshots. Now for advanced settings, I left all of this unchecked. The only thing I did was under processing threads, I, I upped it to the maximum. Mine is 8, so I set it up for 8. And that's it. That's it. So I hope this helps you record your gameplay, whether it's Minecraft or whatever game you want to record, 
and some other first person shooter uh, the settings would probably work just as well for those other games I, I'm just speaking from my experience I record Minecraft so I hope this helped you and if you have any questions just leave a comment and that's it thank you bye bye